This program is being brought to you in part by MedMovie. Illustrating life. Powerful visuals for health and medicine. American Health Journal, brought to you by Amgen. Since 1980, the world's largest independent biotechnology company, reaching millions of patients around the world. The American Health Journal is brought to you by the National Healthcare Media Organization, bringing the latest in healthcare education to the American home. The American Health Journal, bringing you the latest information on medicine, psychology, diagnosis, treatment, and prevention. Major medical advances are made each week, and each week the American Health Journal keeps you up to date. This week on the American Health Journal, we'll have a two-part segment on how your own stem cells can be used to treat your orthopedic conditions. Next, we all know obesity can cause many health problems, but can it also protect you from... We know that being overweight or obese can increase our risk for developing diabetes, heart problems, and kidney disease. But now, some researchers are finding that some people are more likely to survive a chronic illness if they carry extra weight. Researcher and physician Dr. Kamyar Kalantar at LA Biomed discusses the obesity paradox. Obesity is associated with uh, unfavorable outcomes. However, there have been emerging data suggesting that some degree of obesity may not be as unfavorable as it has been claimed. Now, this becomes especially important when uh, uh, high body mass index and higher uh, body size and weight is considered in the setting of certain disease conditions. If you have more advanced stages of chronic kidney disease, if your body mass index, that means your weight divided by height square, is higher, you have more or better chance of survival. That's a paradox. Dr. Kalantar, what do you say to the dialysis patients when they ask you about losing weight? At the uh, point where your kidney is damaged, where your heart has uh, some moderate to serious disease, at that point, the same, the very obesity is not going to be on your side. And when dialysis patients ask me similar question, and these are patients whose kidney or whose kidneys don't work anymore, therefore they're dependent on kidney dialysis three times a week. When they ask me, doctor, can I lose weight? I finally say to lose weight. I said, no, that's not a good idea. This is not the best time based on uh, data from our research group as well as other research, group, uh, research groups that Having some body mass index is associated with better survival in these patients. Dr. Kalantar talks about how years ago, storing nutritional reserves helped in some people surviving chronic disease. In the past, and when I say in the past, I'm talking about the entire history of mankind until maybe 40 or 50 years ago, until World War II, we still were able to survive by being able to store fat. That was the so-called traditional hardship. The new hardship nowadays are chronic disease states. And as we get older, there is little doubt that almost all of us at some point in time, about 55, 60, 70s, are going to have one or two or more of those, those chronic disease states. And here's the question. What could help us to survive those new types of hardships, right? Obesity is one of them. What we are saying that probably the, the black and white approach to obesity is not correct. To use one single approach that obesity is bad no matter what. Obesity is bad even if you have heart, if, if you have heart disease. Obesity is bad if you are 95 years old. You have at the age of 93 years old, for example, a 93 year old lady goes to primary care doctor and his or, or her body mass index is above 35. The first thing that nowadays our healthcare professionals 
tell this, the, that patient is that, well, your body mass is above 35, you have to lose weight. That's probably not correct, right? The, the, the reason that lady is sitting in front of you at the age of 93 is because probably she managed to maintain some nutritional reserve. Telling her at this age to lose weight is probably not in the best interest of that lady. So this is very important to qualify uh, what, what is obesity, what is body mass index, where it is good, where it's not good. And, and our research goes to that direction, to, uh, uh, to identify settings, populations, uh, ages, uh, demographics where some degree of obesity may confer advantages, including survival advantages to, to certain people. You're watching the American Health Journal, the show that brings you the latest information on prevention, diagnosis, treatment, and research from doctors throughout the United States. Watch the American Health Journal each week on this public television station. We thank you for watching the American Health Journal. We wish to thank the doctors, hospitals, and medical professionals for their contribution in making this program possible. And if you would like to see this program online today, please go to thedoctorshow.com. Click on the Shows tab and look for Latest Shows. As always, we will continue to bring you the latest health information for your better health. For the American Health Journal, I'm Chris Long.